Hola a todos, ¿qué tal está? Bienvenidos a mi canal, bienvenidos a un capítulo nuevo de The Walking Dead. Vale, en el anterior capítulo ya acabamos el primer episodio, entonces ahora vamos a empezar el segundo. Eh, supongo que es jugar y... Supongo que... Podemos continuar, ¿no? Sí, vale. Episodio 2, hambrientos de ayuda. Vale, vamos a ver. Recordemos que nos quedamos en el motel S y lo dejé suponimos que eso era un lugar seguro entonces seguramente ya vimos el a ver qué pasa ah, mira. como si fuera una serie oh, You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug. You got it, boss. Son of a bitch. Este. Este es un cabrón, eh. Este casi... Casi nos mata, eh. En el primer capítulo. Primer episodio. Se la tengo curada, eh. Lo tengo... Lo tengo enfilado, este. A la mínima que pueda. God. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, you watch your ass. Ya veremos, Larry. Ya veremos. Parece que ha pasado tiempo, ¿no? Ahora es otoño. Tres meses después, ¿eh? Uh, pues nada. ¿Y qué estaba comiendo? Damn. ¿Qué get this time? ¿Y este quién es? ¿Quién es este? I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. Yeah, rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark, but I'd take it. We're all hungry. No kidding. Este debía ser un tío que estaba en el motel también. When I accidentally grabbed for Carly's rations the other night, I thought she was going to take off my hand. We're all on edge. Just cut us some slack. Yeah, you're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. We'll manage. Maybe. You know, some people aren't too happy about the way Lily's handling rations. Lily knows it's important to keep the adults fed and functioning. Sometimes that means someone's got to miss a meal. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Yeah, between the lack of food and Kenny and Lily fighting all the time, things are getting pretty tense back at the motor inn. You know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that off. Kenny era el padre de, de Doc, ¿no? El tío de, del bigote. Eh, uh, sí. Kenny won't abandon us. He's a good man. Yeah, I guess we'll see. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going Kenny, off on him Kenny. last night? Me cae bien. What's the old guy's deal, anyway? Seems like he's got a problem with you in particular. Ni que lo digas. He thinks I'm a danger to the group and Clementine. I think he's the one putting us in danger. The way Lily worries about his health, I wouldn't be surprised if she's been skimming rations for him. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker, but the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? Uh, knock me flat. Y casi... Casi nos matan, los putos zombies.
Silencio. Me fío de este tío. Dejemos que se concentre. Joder, tío. Shit, was that Kenny? I don't know. Come on. Espero que no. Una para osos. Jesus Christ! Oh shit! No, no! Please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher. We'll leave. I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Get, get it off! Get it off! God damn it! Get, get it off me! Oof. Travis, maybe they can help. These might be the same guys that raided our camp, and we barely got away from that. What guys? Why the fuck is there a bear trap out here? I don't know, man. Tranquilo, no tenemos okay. daño. We're not gonna hurt you. Tranquilizarlos un poco, listen, los chavales. Please, just let us go. We're not a threat to you. Can't chill out. We'll try to help you, but you gotta shut the fuck up. He's fucked up. We've gotta help him. Please. Ben, shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Just see if you can get him out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. Eh, va, intentaremos. We gotta get him out of there. Echarás una mano. Oh God, thank you. Fine, but you gotta hurry. Sí, porque van a venir zombies. Hurry, please, Pegado un tío que flipas. ¿Ves? Es que. Joder. ¿Qué dices? Hostia, que habrá que dejar al tío este. Buah. Ayúdale. Venga, va. Que todo lo que pueda. A que le voy a cortar la mano. Ah, no, el pie. No quiero cargarme. No quiero cargar. La fiesta no, tío. La pierna no. Con la mano no. Pues amigo, lo siento mucho, eh. Lo siento muchísimo. Es que no puedo, tío. No hay ninguna. Va, voy a intentar otra vez, eh. Lo voy a intentar, eh. Pero. Lo siento, amigo, tío. Lo siento mucho. Y la cadena. Vale, vale, vale. Madre mía. Otra vez. Por Dios. ¿Ya está? ¿Ya está, no? Y la última va. Pues venga, va, cogedlo y nos vamos. Vamos rápido. Correcto. Lo he intentado, eh. He intentado liberarlo, pero. Travis, come on, come on, we gotta move. Corre. Empezamos bien, empezamos muy bien, sí, sí. De hecho todo lo posible para liberar al tío, al final palma el otro chaval. Pues nada. Aquí está Larry. Hambrientos de ayuda. Es que 
no pueden estar toda la vida aquí. No. Que hagan un fuerte y tal. Hay que moverse. Niña, para allá con el puto balón. <risa> Get the gates open. We've got wounded. Shit. What the hell are they doing? Come on, come on. God. Claro. What happened? Oh, God. Hell, we don't have time to explain. Me? Are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll see what I can do. Cat, okay? Can you fix him? Jesus, Ken. Lee. I, I don't know. Lee. It's veterinary, no? Esto? What the hell? Creo you sí. can't just be bringing new people here. What are you thinking? Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking hey, minute? What's no, your mouth? I don't. I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. He would have died if we left him. So what? We are not responsible for every struggling survivor we come across. We have to focus on our group. Right here, right now. Well, hang on. We haven't even talked to these people yet. Maybe they can be helpful. Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. Esta me recuerda mucho a, a Rick. A Rick, el carácter que tiene es parecido a, a Rick de la serie de Walking Dead. Welcome to the family, kid. Come over here and see what I drew. What? No, I... Just come on, okay? You know, you like to think you're the leader of this little group, but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. <laughs> oh, come on, you're being dramatic. Everything always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not gonna be a part of that. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around, but now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. It doesn't matter who's in charge. Those people are here now. I guess we just have to decide what happens no, next. No, Lee, it does matter. One person can't be in charge of everything. You know, it might feel safe for you to sit on the fence, but sooner or later you're gonna have to decide whose side you're on. I don't see any of you stepping up to make Too the hard decisions. Deal. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, please. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? Eso. Vete, vete lejos, tío. Tengo una manía este tío. <laughs> you think this is easy for me? Everyone's starting to hate me because I'm the one that rations the food, but nobody else wants to. Ser el líder, el líder you tiene que what? ser difícil, yo, yo, yo lo entiendo, eh. You do it. There's today's food rations, but there's not enough for everyone. Good luck. <laughs> Decide quién come y quién no. Es, es duro, es. Es muy duro. Cuatro cosas. Tengo que decidirlo yo, ¿eh? Vale, vamos a ver. Vamos a hablar con. No me acuerdo cómo se llama. Sí, hombre. Eh, claro. What do you need? Just apply some pressure here while I try to close this up. You know, I thought I was starting to get used to this, sewing up people's injuries. But I mean, cuts and bruises are one thing, but Lee, this man has no leg. <laughs> uh, I did the right thing. Yeah, I know you did. The right thing is just scary sometimes, I guess. Well, you've done all you can, Lee. Thanks for the help. Go ahead and check in on the others. I need a little space here anyway. Vale, vamos a hablar un poco con, con todos. ¿Qué es esto? Ah, la, la barricada. Sturdy, but it's not gonna hold up forever, just like the rest of this place. Correcto. Para que moverse. ¿eh? 
tarde o temprano. A ver, cuéntame un poco. Bueno, ¿Cómo se llama el nuevo al menos? Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Pues claro. Eh, sí. Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. A ver, tío. Cuéntame un poco qué hey, eres. Is my friend gonna make it? I don't know, but Kaja will do her best. I promise. I can't believe you chopped off his leg. There was no other way. So who are ¿Quién you eres? people? Our group's gonna want to know. I'm Ben. Ben Paul. The man you saved is Mr. Parker, the band director at my school. We all came down from Stone Mountain for the playoffs when... when everything happened. How you holding up, kid? Uh, well, I, uh... I keep wondering if I could have done something to help, you know? Some kind of... I don't know. Algo, no? Something. Hiciste lo que pudiste. I'm sure you did all you could. Yeah, maybe. De momento, lo de la comida lo vamos a dejar para el final. O ya decidirá ver. Voy a hablar un poco con todos primero. Y luego decidiré... A ver qué le de la comida. A ver, Clem, ¿cómo estás? ¿Qué es comida? ¿Estás bien? ¿Cómo estás, Clementine? ¿Todo bien? Sí. ¿Ese hombre va a estar bien? Pues no estoy seguro. Espero que lo haga. I'm so hungry, Lee. I hope I get to eat soon. Uh, How are you doing, Doc? I'm okay. Me and Clementine are coloring. Guess what it is? I don't know. A dog? Tío, un nope. gato. Oh, I know. It's a goat, right? What the fuck? No. <laughs> no, no dibuja tan mal. You were pretty brave when we brought those people Es un gato. There. That's because I know Mom can fix him. Vale. Catch you later, Duck. Bye, Lee. A ver, Carly. Um... Lily has me handing out the food. Ugh, that can't be an easy job. It's not. I won't be able to feed everyone. What should I do? Well, if I wanted to get in good with Lily, I'd make sure Larry gets some food. You know that guy can be a real dick sometimes. <laughs> On the other hand, giving that food to Kenny and his family might make him remember you if he decides to take off in that RV one day. What about you? You need food too. We all need food. I can't tell you what to do, but whatever happens, I know you'll be trying to do the right thing. Thanks, Carly. Lo que me gustaría hacer es si pudiese partir la comida, dársela no. entre los niños, los dos que cogieran una ración, beds, no sé. No, I'm not. Drugstore. Yeah. Back in a bit. Vale, uh, Kenny, ver qué qué me cuentas. Words getting out that you want to leave the motor in. That ain't no secret, Lee. It's probably our best bet. Look, you've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters, and you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. You and Clem are welcome to come with us. Es una muy buena opción, eh? La costa? Ah, la costa. Vale. The coast does sound like a smart idea. Maybe that is the best thing. I know that it is. I'm taking my family. Vale, Duke se quiere pirar. Uh, no hay nada por ahí, ¿no? Vale. Vamos a hablar con. Con los otros que quedan. Con Larry, a ver qué me cuenta el capullo ese. Y esto es la barricada, ¿no? Sí. It keeps the walkers out. Carly's been doing the bulk of the lookout duty. Will you hold the damn board steady? I'm trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? 
Oh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. Menudo capullo, tío. Hey, you holding up okay, Lee? I was pretty fucked up back there, having to cut that guy's leg off. Yeah, I just hope Kadja can save him. Lily's pretty pissed at us. Listen, I know her intentions are good, but... But nothing! She's making the smart choice. Those parasites you guys brought back need to go. Tienen, tienen razón y, y no, o sea, dejarlos ir, o sea, echarlos, pues es, es cruel, ¿no? Pero claro, es que es quedarse y es que no hay comida. Entonces, uh, no sé. Complicado, es complicado. I mean, this wall isn't exactly military standard. No way I'm going back there. You saw what it was like when you guys picked me up. Completely overrun. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. Um, te lo doy a ti, Mark. Te la reno, Here, Mark, this should help. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. Tú you te didn't vas a callar, think to give me the axe? Come on, Larry, give it a rest. I'm sure Lee is getting pretty sick of you thinking he's a danger to the group. Pues sí, tío. Is that what you told him? Pues sí, tío. Yeah, that's right. And what are you going to do about it? Look, I don't care what it is, but you two have got to start trying to get along. The only thing I have to do is protect my daughter. And right now that means getting this damn wall fixed. So I would appreciate it if you two would shut up and let me get back to work. <laughs> Menudo capullo, eh? Es que, es que no hay manera de razonar con este tío. No hay manera, eh? Uh, a ver, payaso, ¿qué me cuentas? Uh, uh, uh. You've got to talk to Lily about getting along with Kenny. Lily can make her own friends. It's not about making friends. We're all in this together. We got to start acting like it. Uh, stuff all that. We'd be fine without you. No hay manera, eh? Lily thinks we should throw these new people out. Damn right. There's too many people hanging around here as it is. Keep up on that fence. Don't tell me what to do, Lee. Vale, entonces, uh, ¿puedo hablar con Lily desde aquí abajo o qué? Creo que no llego. Ah, sí, sí, sí que llego. Mm -hmm. Deberíamos hablar primero. We should talk about Pero... you and Kenny. What about us? The arguing. It's getting pretty out of hand. You know people notice that. Look, I'm working my ass off to make sure we have a good setup here, and Kenny just doesn't appreciate that. All we need is food. But there is no food. You know that better than anyone. Well, we'll just have to find some. Por vale. <laughs> Maybe we should think about leaving the motel. God, not you too. I know Kenny wants to leave. I think that's why he's so eager to get the RV working. But this is a good spot. We're protected, we're close to the drugstore, we have a routine now and it's working. For now. Keep an eye out. Fine. Vale, entonces, solo me queda dar de comer a la gente. Tengo cuatro raciones. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, sí. Entonces... Quizá la idea más inteligente sería darle una Kenny una a Lily y las otras dos es que es, no sé y yo no me lo puedo dar a mí mismo no 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 tiene pinta uno dos tres Carly y quizá al chaval nuevo, que es el que era su comida, entonces yo creo que es. Los niños no van a comer, esto es una putada. Pero. Tiene que crecer y tal, ¿no? Entonces vamos a dejar. Le voy a dar una Lily. Lily, pilla. 
Ah, vale, que le puedo dar... Eh, da igual, ¿no? ¿Cuál, ¿Cuál escoger o qué? Media manzana, carne seca, galletas y queso. ¿Entonces solo tengo tres? Te doy la carne seca. Va, tienes pinta de carne seca. <risa> ah, mira, ah, este es un asco. Oh. Tómalo, va. Take it anyway. You need to eat. This doesn't change anything. Que sí, pesada, hombre, madre mía, si es que. Quedan tres piezas de comida. Eh, Le voy a dar otra a Kenny. Want something to eat? La mitad de una manzana. Galletas y queso. Va, manzana. Here, Kenny, take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Eh, no. Uh, no. Come talk to me once my boy's taken care of. Mierda. Me cago en todo. <ríe> o sea, entonces, no le puedo dar nada a Kenny si no le doy a Duke. Uh, y no pueden compartir. Es que, joder. No pueden compartir nada estos dos, ¿o qué? A ver, chaval. Hey, Doc. How about a little food? Dar galletas y queso. Ay, pobre chaval, me sabe, me sabe mal ahora. Uh... Mierda. Pues no sé qué hacer, ¿eh? Esto, esto es como un juego de tronos, tío. Si le das a uno, te quedas bien con él, pero quedas mal con otro, es, es una mierda. Um... Sorry. Vale. Es que antes prefería dársela a la niña, tío. Se lo doy a Clementine, ¿o qué? Va a Clementine. Come un poco, niño. Clem, you need something to eat. Toma las galletas. Okay. A Sunday would be better next time. <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. Pero comparte si puedes, por favor. <laughs> you have any more food? Duck is hungry too. Yeah, why don't we then get some food? Quedan dos pedazos de comida, pero los dos pedazos, o sea, o uno es para mí ya de por sí, o cómo va esto, es que no lo sé. Yo le quería dar a esta, pero... Se lo voy a dar al chaval nuevo, al chaval nuevo, al... Ah, ¿Cómo se llama este? No acuerdo. Mark, porque es, es su comida en teoría, entonces creo que se lo merece. Y aparte de salir con nosotros a cazar. Here, eat something. Ah, vale. Vale. Dar galletas y queso. O sea, tengo dos. Entonces. Me quedan dos más. Te voy a dar la manzana. You got your apple. Wow. Thanks a lot. That's, that's awesome. Y solo me queda alguien más. Oh, some of these people have gone longer than me without food. They're the ones that need it. Venga, va. Y se lo voy a dar a Duke. Me sale mal por Larry. Hay por Larry por Kenny. Hey, Pero, Doc, chaval. Venga, va. Here. Yeah. Oh man, I'm so hungry. Y ya está. Comida repartida. La hija de perra esta no, no ha querido comer, pero. Pero come. Not such an easy job, is it? No, no lo es. Cierto. It's okay. I know you're still watching out for me. I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Lee. Kitty, 
I know I ran out of food before. Hey, it was a tough choice, but you took care of the kids. That's what a real man does. I'm serious about that offer to come with us. You've more than earned a ride on the RV with me. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. You're out! What happened to my food? Oh, dear. There's none left. No lo trago, eh? no you lo trago. keep treating people like this, and your days in this group are numbered. You're one to talk, old man. Yeah, well, I don't see you working on that wall. Pero está buscando comida, tío. ¿Qué más quieres? Yo cogería y me largaba con, con Ken, Kenny, tío. Ken, Lee, come here, please. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. God damn it. I'm muerto? getting sick of this shit. Ken, come back. There's nothing... What's his problem? Don't be like that, Lee. I know we've all seen death, but that doesn't make it any easier. That man you brought, I tried. But he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. What sí, about the other kid? Tenemos otro más. ¿Qué, qué, 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 qué? Coño, 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 coño. Rápido, rápido. Hijo de perra. Pero... No. ¿Cómo? ¿Qué puntería tienes, tío? Da, dame, dame la hacha a mí. Dame la hacha a mí. No, no, no me guardas. No me guardas. Dame la hacha, dame la hacha. Me cago en todo, tío. Pero si tiro para atrás. He muerto. A ver. Patada para ti Patada, patada No Venga Para atrás, para atrás, para atrás, para atrás, para atrás, para atrás Vale Pero otra vez Mátalo Wow. You okay? Yeah. Tip. Thanks. Por suerte. Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed. Why didn't you tell us he was bitten? What? He was bitten, and you didn't say a goddamn claro. word. But he wasn't bitten. I swear. Well, you're not bitten. Se convierte en morir. Es, es verdad, no me tried to kill my wife. What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? Estamos, estamos infectados todos. ¿Qué hace? You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. We're all infected. Everyone. I I guess so. I don't know. I all I know is that I've seen people turn who I know were never bitten. When I first saw it happen. We were all hiding out in a gym, and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning, and... God. Back off! Whoa, lady, relax. Me and my brother, we, we just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off! Carly. Um uh... Are you armed? Yeah. F for protection. Dead could be anywhere. But uh, no feel, eh? I think you got the upper hand here. Why do you need gas? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. Es una buena opción, pero es que quizás está mintiendo. Check the place out. See if it's legit. I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. 
So, uh, what are y'all thinking? Uh, iremos a echar un vistazo. You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Sounds fair. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for a while. So, this dairy... No puedo fiarme, eh? Really Pero... Sure la comida do. es... We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. It's nice to get away from that motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. Mm. You think they'd want me for a leader? Sure. Everybody looks up to you. Well, not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Because of your past. Does anyone else know? Uh, Larry. Larry knows. Great. That can't be easy. Nope. Clementine but knows. Enough. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore and asked me about it. I couldn't lie to her. What exactly did happen with the senator? You know what happened. I only know what the press was told. I don't know your story. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Not sure everyone would see it that way. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. I am. Uh... I really appreciate that. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? I grew up in Macon. Right here in the heart of Georgia. That's what I like to hear. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor inn. Uh, who's running things over there? Eh... Uh... All of us looking out for each other. I hear that. There's so many dumbasses out there fighting each other these days. It's just stupid. How many people you got over there anyway? Demasiadas preguntas, eh? Demasiadas preguntas. Suficientes. Enough to defend ourselves. Well, that's good. It's getting dangerous out there. Well, you guys know. Well, we'd love to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mama's been running the dairy for well, as long as I can remember, but uh, now it's. You getting... think you're going to cut me out of this? Shit, get down. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always Fucking pulling this shit. Bandits. Who? Those look like the people who oh, raided man, my camp. Who are home. they? Shh. Fuck you! Fucking you knew we were hungry, they are. and you guys were keeping it all yourself. Tell. Oh no, there's more. Yeah, and you know what? We ate it all. What are you gonna fucking do about it? Don't worry, Danny and I got you covered if something happens. But let's just wait this out. And I hope they move on. Fuck you! Hello. Fuck you! Fuck you! Jesus! Hola, tío. Están pirados. Les acaban de demostrar que están pirados. El mundo aquí ha ido a la mierda. Vamos, vamos a la dairy donde es seguro. Uff, mala pinta tiene esto. Bueno. Here it is. St. John Family Dairy. Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. That's not terrific, guys. The fence keeps them out. You betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with generators and amps. Te sirve para los vivos, pero para los muertos, yo creo que que no, no. Ever have any accidents? Nah. It's safer here than out there. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. 
I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John, and welcome to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He's from Macon. A couple of our old farm hands were from Macon. They grow them good there. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? Hmm. We all work together. Plus, we've got plenty of people with military experience. Well, that's good to hear. That motel ain't the safest place. Now that y'all are here, we'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. Demasiado bonito esto, eh? Uh... We're all hungry. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Mm, bien. Amazing. Can't get stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, es que that's eso, for eh? sure. That's right. Hopefully Maybelle will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? What she... We have a vet, but we could bring her here. We can help you folks out. A um, vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered! Maybe our whole group could come. For the day. Wait, well, how oh. about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. It'll be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip over here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. Bullet. Mark, Lee, why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. This place is incredible. It's got food. Pinta demasiado bien, eh? Fence? Demasiado. Oh, man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? Sí, vamos a asegurarnos de que el lugar es seguro. Before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Right. Obviously, they think it's safe. But is it safe enough for the kids? I noticed a broken swing over there. Not a big deal, but maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see yet. And checking the fence perimeter well, sounds well, like well. a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. All right, I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. Vale, pues nada, pues vamos a dejar el capítulo aquí. Ya hemos visto, bueno, hemos llegado hasta la lechería. Es un buen lugar para 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 venir, ya que es relativamente seguro para las paredes electrificadas y tal, obviamente no es 100% seguro, pero pero mejor que el motel ese mugriento, pues sí que es y aparte hay comida, tiene una vaca y pueden hacer leche, queso, entonces sería una buena opción si es que de verdad esta gente son fiables pues de venir aquí y estarnos aquí en fin tíos uh, voy a dejar el capítulo aquí, así que nos vemos en el siguiente capítulo de The Walking Dead, así que hasta luego adiós